I'm just grateful that I'm going to attend the boot camp. I'm so grateful. I don't know what I will find there, but I'm going to attend the boot camp. Oh, you know what I'm going By the name is Amnega Gamorita from St. Joseph Vocation Training Center. I'm pursuing a national certificate in plumbing. I wanted to learn more about water. Since plumbing contains very many things, insulation is external, both external and internal. <laughs> Skills enhances dignity. So we believe that the provisions of skills will enhance the dignity of the young people and they will be able to live their life in a dignified way. So at Don Bosco Tech Africa, that's what we are trying to coordinate and be able to help the institutions uh, have good governance, uh, be able to uh, build up the capacities of the teachers, uh, have the best equipment they can have for these young people. Their curriculum should be able to be responsive to the needs of the labor market, know that it is isolated from the labor market. And they should also be networked with the different organizations which could be having similar interest with what we are doing. The World Skills is really the powerhouse where we send our World Skills experts coming from Australia, from UK, from India, South Africa and Namibia. And these experts have been working with the trainers from Don Bosco Tech Africa, who are the multipliers to pass on knowledge to students who otherwise don't have easy access to quality education and training. The way world skills people do their skills, and what we do, the difference is huge. For us, we train learners to go and do in the industry. What is on demand in the Ugandan market, for instance, is what we train them to do. But here at World Skills, it is that is not enough. They train skill at a level where you can go and practice it even elsewhere. So from this interaction here and from this training, now we are able to train students who can go and practice these skills outside. <laughs> I want to develop my skills in order to fit in this contemporary world because things are changing down the night. Because there are some things which they have also brought for us to use, but when we don't know them. So if they still continue coming, coming, we shall fit in this contemporary world. What we are doing is we're doing a lot more practical application. Sometimes trainers want to sit there and give the learners a task and disappear. For me, a trainer is the one that's sharing and a trainer needs to be with the learner. So I'm busy trying to also get the, the trainers to understand their role is not just to give knowledge. Their role is to take that knowledge and do it into an applied competence. And that's what we're trying to do. The reason as to why such programs should come in is for the educators to get exposed to the machineries, to certain different tools, do more and more of the practical so that when you go to a class to deliver something, you are sure of what you do. This bootcamp has also added more on the A's. If I go to my students, I should encourage them to be confident believe in themselves, use the right tool for the right work.
Danny Black and Decker is our partner to provide the funding to support this program through their Empower Makers, whose mission through Makers Grant is to breach the skills gap, especially in construction and manufacturing industry. And this program is aiming exactly that. Just of recent, our borehole got some problems, but they were looking for an engineer who can <laughs> repair it. So I was among the persons who were picked in the village to go and repair it, and it's now working. I left there just of recent on Sunday when it is working. The outcome that we really want to see from the program after the book camp is that collaboration between government, between private sector and, and educators, that Don Bosco is, is going to help lead this forward and that that will then eventually become a pilot that they can do not just in Uganda but in other countries where Don Bosco has TV centers. We really believe in the power of skills to change lives of young people and, and their communities. After my boot camp, I have also to teach my fellow students how to use these materials which they have both us, which I've never used before.